I'm Dr. Oka from Neogenesis Systems and Live Blood Online. So we're going to look at how to break up the live blood sample for pleomorphic analysis in dark field. Now, in some cases, you would leave the sample to stand for several hours to look at how the blood cells degenerate over time. Um, but to save time and to um, enable you to look at the sample straight away, um, you can also break the sample up by using the back of a pen and just running it across the top of the cover slip. So we're just going to make some space by moving the 40 times objective out of the way. We'll hold the slide on the one side and we're just going to run across the cover slip in a sort of zigzag motion, applying a bit of pressure with the pen to break up the blood cells. So literally just from the one side over to the other side. Okay, we're going to put the 40 times objective back into position. We're still in focus. All we'll need to do now is just move around in the sample and um, look for any pleomorphic anomalies. Usually the ideal area, you can reduce the magnification to find an ideal area. Scan around a bit, look for some of the blood cells and we'll look in between where the broken cells are and fragments of cells. That's usually where you will find all the various pleomorphic anomalies like acids, sunacids and chondrites.